Our province does not have a good record protecting at-risk species. Accusations tonight, the B.C. government isn't doing enough to protect one of the most endangered species in the country. There are as few as a dozen spotted owls living in an old-growth forest on the shores of Chilliwack Lake. The trees have long been protected, but earlier this year, the province quietly approved logging in the area. Environmentalists and locals are calling it an emergency, and Linda Aylesworth has more. On a cold and misty morning in the Chilliwack River Valley, residents gather near Post Creek, anxious to welcome an old neighbor back, back the to the fold. And, and, uh, we built the log cabin for the family right over there. He is Member of Parliament Peter Julian, and he has returned in answer to a call for help. And hopefully we we'll can stop the logging and bring this area back to being a protected area. So hopefully, Peter, you can help us do that. <laughs> I'd, I'd love to. The area they're talking about was protected from logging in 2006 by the Ministry of Environment, which recognized that this old Douglas fir forest near Chilliwack Lake was ideal habitat for one of the province's most endangered species, the spotted owl, an animal on the brink of extinction due to loss of habitat. Well, in 2011, the provincial government changed everything. They, this forest is now out of the hands of the Ministry of Environment. It's into the hands of the Ministry of Natural Resources. They expanded the boundaries of the protected forest, but they gave a logging company permission to put in 13 cut blocks. The government justifies its decision by pointing out that the area available for harvesting is a tiny fraction of the total area the province has set aside for management of the spotted owl, and that there has not been a confirmed owl sighting in this harvest area for more than 20 years. This is a place to bring spotted owls back to. The province has a captive breeding program uh, because uh, uh, we have a responsibility to bring this species back from, ex from the brink, but we can't do that if we don't have a place for them to live. There's also the hope that recovering populations of spotted owls just over the border in the U.S. will eventually make their way back to this unique ecosystem. But if most of the large old trees are logged, it would no longer be a viable habitat for them. Absolute outrage. Um, this is the last of the trees like this around here. Everything else has been logged. I don't know what happened with that. It's, they should have protected it if they said it's protected. It, it makes no sense at all uh, we, because we're talking about a few days of, of work ultimately. Ultimately, if the provincial government acts in an irresponsible way, and I believe they're acting irresponsibly in this case, the federal government does have the species at risk legislation. And I believe the federal government should be acting if the provincial government doesn't reverse course. When the cutting might begin is uncertain. The province says that Tamahai logging can't begin until they've obtained a permit, something they have yet to do.